I dreamed of days like this, and I still got so much more to prove. Love the people here, love the fan base, it's unbelievable. The mindset on game day, man, just waking up and getting ready for a big game. I like to dance, so I'm gonna dance. This is game day, coming live to you guys. A new team, new vibe, everything's new. I fell in love with the game of football when I was a little kid. I was about, I say, eight years old. Uh, my mom asked me, like, what do you want to be when you grow up? And I told my mom, I was like, Mom, I want to be an NFL football player. You know, I kept my promise to, you know, live out my life and become a professional player, playing in the league, take care of my family, and uh, that's right now, man, I'm just living the dream. And the mindset, you know, when I wake up on game day, it's just more so uh, just relax in a comfortable state of mind and getting ready for a big game. So for breakfast today, I'm making eggs, bacon, and some toast. It's usually my go-to, uh, you know, usually every morning before, you know, game day. One of the craziest moments um, I had was the perfect hit. People ask me this all the time. Honestly, truly, when I had that hit on Burfick, uh, that week changed my life. For a whole week straight, I was getting free food, everything. It was like, you know, I felt like I was like, you know, the man for about a week. And in that week time, I, I would say like, just because of one hit and one player, you know, had so much impact on that conference in AFC North football, it, it honestly was just like, it, was, it just changed my life at that point. Your fans is everything. You have people traveling all over the world, um, outside of just the United States and stuff. Places like Canada, like Canadian football is such a big thing. And you know, we get so many guys that come over from Canadian football that play in the NFL. And it's unbelievable how, how huge our fan base is. As soon as that ball snapped, I'm, t I'm telling you, I'm a different type of dog. Being able to go from a Hall of Fame quarterback to a quarterback who's going to be, you know, one day in the Hall of Fame is actually very, very nice. And going into this regular season, it's, it's going to be a fun one. Man, y'all beware, man. We coming, man. The Chiefs kingdom is finally here. I'm part of it. That Red Sea is coming for you guys. Let's get it. Thank you.